Saint Cecilia was chosen for the gift of the fear of the Lord. She was chosen because she was fearless in protecting her virginity and in leading her husband and his brother to conversion which led to their martyrdom and the martyrdom of Saint Cecilia. This saint is venerated in the Latin Catholic, Eastern Catholic and Eastern Orthodox churches as well as some churches of the Anglican Communion. Cecilia, a virgin of a noble family and a Christian from her infancy, was given in marriage by her parents to a noble pagan youth, Valerianus. After the marriage, Cecilia told Valerianus that she was betrothed to an angel who jealously guarded her body. Valerianus wished to see the angel, whereupon Celia sent him to meet the bishop and returned a Christian to Cecilia. When Tiburtius, the brother of Valerianus, came to them, he too was won over to Christianity as zealous children of the faith both brothers distributed arms and buried confessors who had died for Christ. They were condemned to death. An office of the prefect, Maximus, appointed to execute this sentence, was himself converted and suffered martyrdom with the two brothers and then Cecilia was taken prisoner. She arranged that her house should be preserved as a place of worship for the church. After a glorious profession of faith, she was condemned to be suffocated in the bath of her own house. However, she remained unhurt in the overheated room. The prefect then had her decapitated. The executioner let his sword fall three times without completing the task and fled, leaving her in a pool of blood. She lived three days and made over all her wealth to the poor. She is buried in the catacomb of Callistus and is known as the patron saint of musicians because as she was dying, she sang to God. Let us pray. Through the intercession of Saint Cecilia, we pray for the gift of the fear of the Lord for all people everywhere, especially those entering the church as new catechumens.